Hello, it's Kylie from Scott Leroy Marketing. Today we're going to be going over how to set up a newsletter to send out to your clients. So the first thing you'll want to do is get all logged into command. And just a side note, in order to send out this newsletter, you want to have your contacts synced up to MailChimp. If you don't have that complete yet, um, we do have another video on that and you can reach out to us. We can get that over to you or if you have any other questions. In the meantime, we're going to come over to the left hand side. We're going to click on campaigns. So clicking on campaigns will take you to the main section here. And in this case, we can come right up to the top right and click on create a new campaign. It'll give you a few options here. And in this case for the newsletter, we're going to want to email that. So email. And it'll take you the, to this page with the configuration steps. So you'll want to make sure you have all these sections filled out before you can send. And if you need to go back and make changes to your list or you know, you're not quite ready to send it, you can always come up and save as a draft or you can preview. So in this case, you know, we'll fill out the information here, choose your list, test, and you'll come down here to the section that says content. If you come to the right, you'll have the option to apply design. And if you click on that, it'll automatically default to these KWRI templates. And you should see two templates is a newsletter style one and newsletter style two. So feel free to take a look at those, decide which one you want to use. Um, but in this case, let's say we want to use style one. You'll go ahead and you can pull that up and you can see on the right hand side here is you can edit all of this information. You can add headlines, dates, um, you can add files and photos. And then once you're finished, you'll go ahead and click on apply design. So in this case, um, just because I don't have all the sections filled out here, I'm just going to go back to templates. But once you have that newsletter template completed, you'll be able to preview and then send your email. So it's as, actually as easy as that as accessing and creating the newsletter. If you do have any further questions on this, you can go ahead and reach out to us at support at Have a great day.